With the release of Resolum 7, we've made some changes to how random playback mode works. This is to give you more control over the randomness inside of your compositions. Let's have a look. Here we have a clip from our Black Dancer pack. Let's remix her dancing with some randomness. First, we'll change the playback mode to random by clicking on the playback mode button and select random. Two additional sliders appear under the transport control. Speed will adjust the playback of the clip. In Resolume 7, the speed no longer affects the random playback. Setting the speed to zero will give you the random behavior from previous versions of Resolume. The interval is the time between jumps. By default, this is a half second, but you can adjust it from five seconds all the way down to a hundred of a second. Distance is the maximum amount that is jumped each time the interval triggers. This can be any time up to the length of the clip. In this first clip, I've set the interval and distance to low values, creating a stuttering effect. And in this second clip, I've added some randomness to a trails effect to create sort of a ghosting vibe. Now let's have a look how BPM Sync works with random playback. Here we have our dancers synced to the BPM. The speed, interval and distance are now measured in beats instead of seconds. By setting the beats to 6, I try to create a shift in movement on chord strikes rather than on the kicks. So that's it, random playback in Resolume 7. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.